Today is March 1st. Hey, Google, what's celebrated on March 1st? According to National Today, March 1st is the 60th day in the Gregorian calendar. Okay, there we go. And it would be 61st if it were a leap year. That's exactly not. what it said. That's what? Yes. I'm basically Google. You're you are welcome. The Google. I'm excited about Dan Wilmot. He's the face that I've seen on so many shows. Mm -hmm. And you've heard his voice. He's done some pretty cool commercials that most people would recognize his voice. Real Canadian Superstore. Smuckers. The Dairy Farmers of Canada. Volkswagen. He also voice. teaches. He's got voice classes. Voice Spot. Here are some of the shows that he's done. Private Eyes. Sheldon Kennedy Story. Umbrella Academy. Murdoch. General Hospital. Mean Girls. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Dan Wilmot. Yeah! Hey! I'm a little nervous. Why? Uh oh. I I've watched the nervous. show. That's why. Oh, oh. <laughs> How did you get started in yeah. acting? What was your spark? When I was five years old, we were watching Peter Pan. And I was just blown away by the fact that these kids could fly. I asked my mom, How do these kids get to fly? And they said, Well, they're actors. Oh. I was bitten by the bug. I wanted to learn how to fly. Why? That's acting 101 is flying. Going to university in Regina, there was a little posting for a job for working overnight in a radio station. And then everybody in the radio station got mono. So they said, okay, Dan, we'll do this show, do this show. And I was on the air all the time. We like to go back and try to find old stuff. This from 1986. What was they doing in 86? Glenmore Dinner Theater presents Brenda Finley. She's a success. And Dan Wilmot. <laughs> He's a good cook. In the hand that cradles the rock. Oh, my. Universal comedy served up with an intimate form course dinner at Glenmore Dinner Theater. We make a lovely couple, don't we? I look exactly the same, too. I did a lot of dinner theater in Calgary. I was a radio personality in Calgary. Oh. And Brenda Finley was an anchor woman in a local TV station. And uh, they threw us together. We had Fab Filippo as a guest in our show. We did way downtown with him. Sounds like something's going on. What kind of something? You know, something, something. Knock on the door. <laughs> loud, knock loud. <laughs> Breakdown said an effeminate junior clerk, and the only thing I could think of doing in the audition was Michael Jackson, so I did a Michael Jackson voice. Most people probably know you from the movie Mean <laughs> Girls. Oh, God. Doesn't she look great, honey? <laughs> Over here, honey. Take your, put your finger in your mouth like this. Do you like it, Daddy? Ah. I get recognized for that more than anything. Amy Poehler, we went out for dinner before we shot the scene, and just to get to know each other, I didn't know who she was. I hadn't been watching Saturday Night Live. I said, wow, I haven't watched it in a while. She said, oh yeah, nobody's watching these days. And then she introduced me. Oh, this is my best friend, Tina Fey. And I said, oh, hi, Tina, what do you do? You were in Fargo with Ewan McGregor. I don't have to carry my accounts over to Chase. Chase, that's a... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> you're such a kidder. You, you really had me going there for it. <laughs> Let me just get my keys. We met the day before. He said, we can go up there and rehearse. See, we're going to shoot tomorrow. And I said, oh, that'd be great. He said, you think cigars would be good? I guess. <laughs> we sat and smoked cigars and rehearsed for a few hours. So he was wow. great that way. He liked it so much that he said, can we get cigars in the scene? So the actual scene has cigars in it as well. Let's talk about Voice Spot. It started in 1996. Build a voiceover community in Alberta. We started doing classes. With the pandemic, we went online. The things we've added now is home studios. You can now work anywhere in the world. Can you just do a little commercial for Snack? Subscribe to Snack now. Oh, I'm subscribing. If people want to follow you, danwilmot.com. Or voicespot.ca. Dan Wilmot. Thank you. Thanks Thank for you so much. It wasn't too scary, was it, Dan? Yes, it was. Good. Good. <laughs> I've, I've seen the research you guys do, so that terrified me. Thanks, Dan. Bye. Take care. I love his spot. Thank you for asking him to do that really quick spot. That was awesome. Like. Share. Comment. Subscribe to Snap Now.